LifeBulb is a patient empowerment platform that focuses on reducing the burden of chronic disease. It's a company that I co-founded four years ago together with Ricardo Braglia and Steve Squinto. Our key concepts are patient ambassadors and patient entrepreneurs. Patient ambassadors are individuals who are leaders in the community and they inspire and motivate others to live a healthier and happier life. Patient entrepreneurs are really interesting individuals. They are not sitting back waiting for solutions, but they're out there creating products and companies that will address the daily burdens that they themselves go through. My name is Nina. Hi, my name is Gunilla. Hi, I'm Rebecca. Hi, my name is Dane Johnson. Hi, I'm Aaron. My name is Tara. I tested positive for the abnormal BRCA gene and removed my ovaries. I suffer from chronic eye disease. I was diagnosed with ulcerative colitis 24 years ago. The last year I had my colon removed, so I'm dealing with a new set of challenges. I was diagnosed with lupus when I was 18. I'm a mother of four and a passionate advocate for pediatric brain cancer research. I suffer from surgical menopause and hormone treatment is not an option for me. My son Walker was diagnosed with a medulloblastoma 20 months ago. I fear losing my eyesight and not being able to read my papers in the morning and appreciate all my surroundings. The thing that's probably the most challenging every day is that I have a chronic disease that's really silent. From the outside, I may look happy and healthy and feeling great, but on the inside, I'm exhausted. I'm dealing with medications and side effects of those medications. And I definitely still know where every bathroom is within a five mile radius of anywhere I am. The hardest part of living with lupus is all the medication you have to take for the variety of symptoms that pop up. Each and every day, I worry about many of the side effects from his treatment. The long-term side effects of radiation to the brain and spine, his nutrition so that he can grow, as his GI tract was completely destroyed by the chemo. I wish I could sail around the world and not have to worry about mammograms every six months. If I had one wish, it would be that I'd never have to miss out on anything uh, due to a flare-up. And if I could have a dream, anything I want in the world, it would probably be just to eat a salad again because with no colon you can't eat salad, raw fruits, vegetables, and all sorts of things like that. If I could eat it in India, that would be even better. So I have type 1 diabetes. I have two transplants and a pacemaker. My goal for everyone living with any chronic disease is to find a cure. That's been my goal since I was diagnosed with type 1 diabetes. Over these almost 30 years, I realized that a cure will be here one day. But during that time when we support research, we identify those kind of best solutions that potentially could lead to cures, we need to reduce disease burden right now.